soccer. Yeah, say hi. Hi. Grayson has his soccer jersey on because we are back at the soccer field. We're here a little early, and as you can see, it is raining. So we're waiting until the last possible second to go out to get wet. Good morning, you guys. I am coming at you from a very rainy Saturday. Oh my gosh, I am so, so tired. I filmed that one clip of us painting the living room and then we painted until midnight that night, got it done. And then yesterday we took all the tape down and started taping out the kitchen because that's the next room we're gonna get to. But, and I had all intentions to vlog yesterday, but I was so busy. I didn't even have a second to like think, <laughs> honestly. Porter has a cold, probably because we went to that indoor play place for Gray's birthday and Chuck E. Cheese, probably got something from there. And so he just wanted me to hold him all day yesterday. So that was really hard. And then it was just crazy busy. Allison and I took the boys to the zoo. So I did take like two clips while and put that here. Isn't that cool? Do you keep walking? and Grace playing in this little cute little playground. Porter's just chilling with me eating some milk. They have a little kid playground for Porter, but he is just wanting to hang with me right now, huh? Yeah, you want mom. some more? Yeah. Yeah, okay, I'll get you more. You want to go on the wagon? Oh yeah, Grace is loving this little toy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, did you drop one? It's okay. I got more. Okay. This is so fun, huh? It was so busy, but the weather was really nice. We went around and like found egg cards and then they got like a little wooden egg and crayons to decorate, so it was cute. Um, but Porter was just miserable the whole time. He ended up puking in the car. Um, it was just a hot mess and then he needed a nap, but he fell asleep in the car, so then he didn't take a nap. And oh my gosh, it was just one thing after another. I was so tired. I was like falling asleep as I was sitting on the couch yesterday at like 11. I was so tired. So now it starts the weekend. It's Saturday, obviously, because we have soccer. We have a very busy couple days coming up. We have uh, soccer now, obviously. And then we are going to go see the Easter Bunny um, later in the day after nap time and get our picture with him. He comes tonight. He's going to fill Grayson and Porter's baskets with some goodies, I think. And then uh, tonight, Anthony and I are going out to dinner with my grandparents. So my parents are gonna watch the kiddos while we go out and we're going to a really fancy dinner. It's called Hyde Park, it's very fancy. So we're gonna go and have some yummy food. So I'm excited about that. And then tomorrow is Easter, which is crazy. Easter always sneaks up on me because of Gray's birthday. I'm so focused on that, I forget about Easter. So that's tomorrow. The boys will be looking for their Easter baskets. And then we're doing dinner at my mom's house. There's like 22 people going. And I have this fun jelly bean game that we're gonna do. So yeah, a couple of busy days. And then I think it all hopefully get better. Um, yeah, so here's soccer. I'm gonna film a little bit and just keep you along with our day.
doing? Um, oh, don't beep the horn. That's loud. What are you guys doing? That's awesome. You beep beep the horn. Yeah, don't do it. No, no more. That's that's only for dogs. Only for adults. Okay, so we are back from Easter Money Picks. I'm so sorry I didn't get any video. I did get pictures, so I'll input those here. <laughs> Easter what bunny. is that? What do you think, Port? Oh. <laughs> is it the Easter Bunny? Gray loved the Easter Bunny. He climbed right onto his lap. Porter was terrified. He was fine until I put him down on the Easter Bunny's lap and walked away and he bawled and cried the whole time. But it's fine. We got it done. We got Easter Bunny pictures done. Um, Soccer was good. Grayson actually stayed out on the field the whole time. He only sat once. So it was a big improvement. He was so good. We went and got ice cream because Lent is over. We gave up ice cream for Lent. So now we can have ice cream. It was so good. Now we're playing for a little bit. And then Anthony and I are going out to dinner with my grandparents. We're going to a fancy restaurant. Um, so that'll be fun. So we're just hanging for a little bit. I just feel like my day has been go, go, go. And I haven't been able to like stop and breathe for a second. So it's a little crazy. I need to get dressed because I need to go in nice clothes. Yeah. But I'm playing with the kiddos right now. So we're just having some fun. Porter is obsessed with playing in cars right now. He frequently tells me, Dada car, mama car. So he likes to just sit and play. Gray's doing some sidewalk chalk. It's beautiful today. It was cold and rainy this morning. And it's still cold, but at least it's sunny now, so it's a little better. So yeah, we're just hanging out. Porter wasn't feeling so great yesterday, but he seems to be doing better today. Darn colds. Hey guys, so it's uh, the evening. Well, it's actually nighttime now. Um, Anthony and I are back from our dinner with my grandparents who took this cute picture with them, so I'll input that here. We went to a super fancy steakhouse. It was so good. It was nice spending time with my grandparents one-on-one. -on -one. Um, we talked a lot about um, this family cruise that we're gonna go on with like all my extended family. So um, that's in two summers from now. It'll be so much fun. So um, we had a great time. We're back, uh, relieved my parents of babysitting. And now we are going to um, tape. Uh, the kitchen and keep going with that but before we did that I almost forgot tomorrow is Easter and so I have been putting together the boys Easter basket so I thought I would show you guys so it's kind of hard but I kept them pretty like basically similar because I mean obviously I have to do that Felix is very intrigued so I included some books um, like I said Meyer always does um, cat in the hat books or Dr. Seuss books um, super cheap during March because it's like read week or read month or whatever. So I got those. Um, some Pez candies because the boys love these. Um, fruit snacks. The boys love gummies. Um, I got them matching bathing suits from Target because we're going to do a lot of swimming this summer. These are my favorite candies right here. So of course I had to get them one for each boy. These are so, so good. If you have not tried these, you should. They are so good. And then I got new sunglasses for the boys. One for Porter, one for Grayson because we're gonna go to Florida. So we're gonna need some sunglasses. Oh, also I got them these bunny bath bombs. We've never done bath bombs before, um, but I thought it would be fun. They love our tablets that change the water, um, the color of the water in a bathtub. Um, so I thought this would be really fun. I think it's more for like teenage kids, but I thought the boys would get a kick out of it So I got one for each boy as well And then I also got them some more bubble toys. We had a bubble gun and it stopped working This was five dollars at Target So I got this and then a bunch of bubble refills to go with it And then we've had bubble wands like this before but they've all like run out of bubbles So I just got a new one. These were like three dollars Super cheap at Target. So they love bubbles. So they will get a kick out of these toys. 
So now I just have to figure out where I'm gonna hide these. I have to hide them somewhere in the house. I didn't hide the baskets last year or any year before that because Grayson was too little, um, but now I feel like Grayson is at a good age. He loves playing hide and seek and Porter just follows him wherever he goes. So I definitely think once I tell them like your Easter baskets are hidden, we have to find it. And then obviously I'll help them find it. But now I gotta figure out where to hide them. And I think I should hide them together just because Porter's not gonna look on his own. So I gotta find a place big enough that I can hide two Easter baskets that's easy enough for them to find. So I'm gonna ask Anthony if he has any ideas, but I just can't believe Easter's tomorrow. I just feel like it snuck up on me. I'm gonna help my mom tomorrow um, cook and um, get ready for Easter dinner and I'll definitely vlog and take you guys along for it. But thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time, bye.